What is up ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog. As you probably see there, I have that Apple Watch springboard demonstration uh, that we posted on IDB yesterday that's been making its way around the web that shows what the Apple Watch UI will look like on an iPhone. Well, if you wanna try that out yourself, you can now. It is a package that has been compiled and been, it's been placed out on the City of Repo that you can go out, you can add that City of Repo to your list of sources on your jailbroken device, and you can try this Apple Watch Springboard demo out for yourself. And it's pretty cool to be able to try this and see how it works. Uh, I think you guys are gonna like this. So first of all, you need to add the actual repo to your list of city of sources and I will have the repo address down below in the uh, in the description of the video and on the post on I download blog but in the meantime let me just show you let's go to our sources uh, okay. unfortunately it has some kind of shady stuff on there as well but our, our goal is to try out um, this um, this uh, demonstration um, so to add that to your sources, you want to add the following uh, repo address, and I'll try to focus in on that here. It is Cydia dot my repo space. I know, don't really like those sources, but in this case, you need to add this uh, Cydia dot my repo space dot com slash lamers with a Z, lamers with a Z. So all you do is you go into Cydia, you go to the uh, sources tab down down below, and then you go to edit. You tap add, and then you just type that address in this little box and tap add source. Once you do, um, this source will appear on your device right here, Lamers. And then you'll see all packages. You just go there. And at the very top, you don't have to scroll down anymore to see anything else. Um, but at the very top, you'll see the Apple Watch Springboard package. You just tap on that. I've already installed it, of course. And it's loading slowly but surely. Uh, looks like more slowly than surely. Let's see if we can go back out, go back in. My Wi-Fi has been acting a little strange. Let's just disconnect from Wi-Fi. There we go. All right, so there is the uh, Apple Watch Springboard package. It's been downloaded 200 times, been recently updated. Um, so all you do is you install this package um, and then you reboot after you install the package. So I have done so. I'm going to show you what this uh, demonstration looks like. So I've already rebooted my device. Actually, let me just swipe over here. All right, so here it is. Here is the uh, package that you will see. It's not the prettiest looking app icon in the world. Um, it's just kind of, uh, let's see here. All it says is like watch springboard. Um, there's no kind of, can't really make any detail out on this camera. But there's no kind of um, you know app icon per se. Uh, it is just a blank white icon. So let's just load it up so I can show you what this looks like here. All right, so there we go. There is what we want. Um, and it is the Apple Watch UI, or that concept UI at least, uh, for, it's not the real Apple Watch UI, but it's a concept um, created by a particular developer that we mentioned on iDownload blog yesterday. I'll have his details in the description of the video as well and on the post. Uh, but as you can see, you can move around with this UI and kind of just play with it. Now, none of the apps here are actual real apps that actually launch. Um, this is just a demonstration to show you how you would peruse and navigate the UI. So uh, it shows you how you could zoom out and then zoom in to a particular spot and even launch an app. And that's what it will look like when it launches. You see the nice little animation. Um, and of course, you can just zoom in. Um, you can look at the various app icons, you can see the text below the app icon, which is a nice little touch there for the iPhone screen. You just tap once and it zooms all out. You tap again, zooms in, you tap on a blink spot and it zooms out again. Um, of course, you can use a pinch to zoom in and zoom out. Pretty interesting little concept here. I highly recommend that you at least try it out if, you, if you're at all interested and what the Apple Watch UI will look like on an iPhone. This is a good way to test it for yourself. Seeing the video is one thing, but actually being able to play with this and, and see it uh, for yourself is actually really cool. Uh, so I do recommend if you have the time to go out there and check this out. Um, I'll again have the um, repo in the description below. I'll also have 
uh, a link where you can see the developer's original original work as well. So, uh, do you like this? Do you like the Apple Watch UI? That's the question. Uh, would you consider, like, if Apple uh, decided to move in this direction, would you consider that to be a positive or a negative thing? Or do you just like your typical layout that has been happening ever since 2007 with iPhone OS, starting with iPhone OS, where you just have the grid of icons and the different pages? I actually kind of like this. It is different. It would answer, uh, it would reply to a lot of people who say, well, iOS hasn't changed in years. And it is kind of true. Like the home screen has not changed in seven years. So, uh, this would definitely be a huge departure from the typical home screen. But again, you run into issues about app organization and things like that. How would your apps be organized, etc. Uh, so again, let me know what you guys think about the uh, Apple Watch UI concept on the iPhone in the comment section down below. Give me a like also if you, if you like this post. And um, that's about it. Talk to you later. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.